we're backstage at Sonosphere and with Wes from Limp Biscuit. How are you? Hi, I'm fantastic. Yeah. Thanks. How long have you been on site today? On site, I, uh, I guess we pulled in at 10.30 in the morning, about. Excited for the set? I am, yeah. yeah. What yeah. have you been up to since we last saw you on the Kerrang! tour? Oh, gosh. I've been traveling a lot. Um, we've been out in Europe now for four weeks. It's been really good. Um, last night, almost died in Paris from how hot it was, so it's a pleasure to be in the out of doors. This is hot for us though, like the sun's yeah, out for once. You know, it's nothing compared to an enclosed club that has its own ecosystem of people's sweat hanging in the air and yeah, so this is nice. What can we expect from your costume today? That's it drying out. <laughs> It's sort of, it smelled bad, kind of like a locker room yeah. before, but now it's starting to take on kind of a fermenting, terrible quality that I'm not pleased. No one's pleased with it. That's why it's been moved outside. So, How yeah. long have you been wearing this one? Three and a half, four weeks. So. And when do you get changed into it before the set? Do you stay in it much before you have to go on? Probably in about an hour I'll get start getting ready. Skeleton cup questions exciting. of doom for you to answer if you want to pick out pick a, a question. question of doom just one? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I think it, is that one or two? I think it's one. Oh. I've lost. <laughs> okay. If you could only hear one song for the rest of time. That's easy the Macarena. Yeah? yeah. Amazing. No. Can you do it though? Now I want to see um, you do it. Uh, if you could only hear one song for the rest of time. Um, how about Cliffs by Apex Twin off Selected Ambient Works 2? How often do you listen to that song? It's, it's sort of like maybe Cliffs or Rhubarb is a good one off that album too. Because it's sort of something that's very soothing and it's kind of repetitive and flowing and moving. It's more like a soundscape with kind of a melody moving underneath it so you can it's not something that's intrusive and I don't know pilot like like jackhammering into yeah. your brain it's you have got to listen to it forever as well yeah yeah so it's very unintrusive music okay. it's more of kind of a background warm soothing I'm on heroin dying kind of music nice. so pick one more question why not, why not? Did that one go well? Yeah, or did I like that, that one. Not go well? No, I like That's that one. We're getting them all. Picking another one. Let's see. What's one thing you've always wanted to say on Twitter? Well, I'm not going to say it on the Krang <laughs> podcast. Is there anything you've said and you've regretted saying it or writing it? No, no. not really. Um, I guess. No, the best the best thing I've ever done on Twitter was I did 110 life tips. Oh, yeah. And if you go back in time, past all the garbage, I'm barely even using Twitter anymore because it kind of got dull to me. But you're big um, on Instagram, though, aren't you? Yeah, I do a lot. Of, I like that a lot. But yeah. uh, my peak on Twitter was last year. I did 110 life tips. Can you remember your favorite tip? Which number it was? I think it was, I don't remember what number any of the tips were, but, um, oh, I, it was, uh, here's a, a, g a pretty good tip. It's not the best one, but um, a wise man once told me that if you're prepared for zombies, you're prepared for anything. And I think I believe that. Definitely. Well, thank you yeah. for that tip. We can go on with the weekend in safety. Thank you, <laughs> thank you so much. Have a good set.